What is up guys, welcome back to another video. In this one, we are going to be going over the best ways to collect the huge colorful wisps inside of the different mini games uh, for Pest Simulator 9. And uh, they're also located in Reboot Chest. But let's just go take a look. And as you can see, guys, there's a classic hobby. And there's like only so much you can do. I mean, you literally just have to complete this hobby and collect it. But what I haven't told you guys, and you may not know this, or you may have known this, but you just don't use this. And that is the hoverboard glitch. That is going to, this is going to get you like in, almost instantaneously the uh, pet. So if I just try to do this glitch right here, as you can see, guys, we have a hoverboard right here. And you can just easily beat this. Like, and uh, that was just a miss right there, guys. But yeah, if you like try, you know, let me just like get on this like yellow uh, ball right here. Like for, I'm, I'm thinking this, uh, classic copy as an example and then you just launch right here as you can see guys that took like 15 seconds and we pretty much got the reward uh can we collect that nope we cannot collect that make sure to collect that rebirth chest first guys if you haven't because it also can get you a chance and there are 17 seconds and we also we already got prizes for the classic obby and you guys can do this with literally every single obby or like any mini game that actually contains this uh, there's not many that contain i think the cartwright for preston and the minefield are just two examples of mini games that are not obbies uh this one you literally just have to do it normally because if i tried to do the glitch on this one right here guys it would just go through here like it wouldn't even go uh activate these buttons and if these buttons don't activate till the end then you, the prize won't activate so disclaimer for this um, um minefield mini game yeah just don't you know use the hoverboard because it won't work you have to do it normally and also guys there's some places that aren't like obbies or mini games like i wouldn't really call this a zen garden or like as you can see guys there's a rebirth chest right here i don't know all the locations of the rebirth chest you guys are gonna have to find that on your own but uh yeah, yeah so i just got the rebirth chest and you guys can just come in here and collect it uh, and it's going to get you a chance of actually getting one of these uh huges also guys I almost forgot make sure to take advantage of these surge boosts that are um on select obbies inside of customer 9 and today it's actually going to be the ice obby but it rotates every single day so if you don't like the obby maybe you know maybe it might land on an obby that you really enjoy to actually complete and you can just do that all day because it's uh it's a surge that, that's active for an entire day and also guys unfortunately i just noticed this but you know they actually increase the cooldown for uh obbies and like literally all of them uh, like the classic obby the cooldown is now like an hour and 30 minutes it used to be around 15 minutes and yeah they just completely like increased it so you can't really do this as often but still guys if you do all of them like all if, if you do all of them with the hoverboard glitch it's going to take you like 20 minutes at most and yeah you'll, you'll have a higher chance of actually collecting these huges and so guys that was a pretty quick video i just wanted to let you guys know because you know this thing was covered in my uh huges video and uh there's a lot more it's, it's a little bit more in depth than that of what i covered and i wanted you guys know just so you guys have the most optimal ways to actually collect this huge and with that guys make sure to subscribe if you want to see more optimal methods of actually collecting any of these huges i'll make more videos in the future this was just like the second video that i've made and so yeah peace